it's so rare to find a love where two things just make sense, where two opposites collide and make one. Whenever I'm around Kristen and people say, oh my God, through high school and college, how did you make that work? Kristen always responds with the same answer. He's just my person. There was just never a question about Kristen and Tyler. It just worked and it always has. Kristen does all the talking and Tyler can get in a few words here and there. So it works out perfect for the both of you. I mean, really. <laughs> Tyler, I want to thank you for making my friend so very happy. She is the most genuine, selfless, caring, thoughtful and extraordinary person I have ever met. And I know you see that too. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you for allowing her to be soft and handling her heart with the best care. You have been everything Kristen has needed even before she knew she needed it. I've had the blessing of watching your love grow and blossom into what it is today. And my God, is it beautiful. I don't even have to wish you two a happily ever after because you have already created one. They really are made for each other. They balance each other, encourage each other, and push each other to become the best versions of themselves. It's something that's clear to everyone who meets you both, and we're all lucky to be here to be a part of your story. I, Tyler, take you, Kristen, to be my wife. I promise to be faithful to you in sickness and in health, to love you all the days of my life. I, Kristen, take you, Tyler, to be my husband. I promise to be faithful to you in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you, and to honor you all the days of my life. It's not every day that you get to see not one, but two of your best friends promise to share the rest of their lives with each other. But for anyone that has known these two, it should come as no surprise that they ended up here. From seemingly every baseball diamond in America, to the shores of South Africa, to the hot dog safaris in Boston, they have grown together. We've come to know these two not only as great friends, but as the best of friends. So we're happy and proud to be standing beside them today as they take the next step the rest of their lives together. My friends, with great privilege, I introduce for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Tyler and Kristen Gauthier. Look at the smile on this guy's face. For those of you who've had a serious conversation with Tyler, or at least asked him a question that would merit a real response, you know there's a 50-50 chance you get a head nod with a raised eyebrow. <laughs> or some form of a caveman grunt. The fact that Kristen has the patience to accurately decipher this caveman language is clear evidence that it was meant to be. <laughs> because after 27 years, I still have no idea. One, never forget to say those three magical words to Kristen. You're right, dear. And two, never laugh at Kristen's choices because you were one of them. I'm buzzing like a beehive. Uh. Sky high on the good vibes, uh, jump in, you can come too, uh, just tell me what you wanna do, yeah. I got something you can't explain, ah, la, la, la. in a metaphysical kind of way, ah, la, 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 la. When your daughter starts dating, you know, you get a little nervous about things, but when she started dating Tyler, I felt uh, a little ease there. But she's been, uh, she's been an amazing daughter from day one. You guys make a great couple. I'm so happy for you. And now there's a new man in your life. But it's okay. I like him. I like him. I just wish he was a little shorter so I could look at him eye to eye. Can you feel 
Dale. Chinese food takeout date nights. Cheers. 